It's weird. Okay, little little closet. Yo, ladies and gentlemen, we are here with uh, a new episode of Fears, Fears to Fathom. I know y'all are probably like, yo, why are you so like excited to play this game? Why don't we find out? <laughs> uh, here we go. Woodbury getaway chat. Fears of Fathom is an episodic psychological horror game where each episode unveils a short narrative by the ones who survived. We are playing episode five. Woodbury getaway. Oh shit. Oh shoot. Fears to Fathom. Episode five. Woodbury getaway. Um, oh my God, Christmas time. This can't be too scary. I love Christmas time. Oh bro. Needed coffee to get done with the day. Dude, nine to five, desk job. Oh my God, bro. Me personally, I will. Me personally, I will. I can't do this shit. This is what I would do. Wait, what? Track, copy. Am I have to, do I have to type? Oh! Oh! Wait. Oh god. Oh god, okay. Was that least? What? Ah! What? Uh! Ah! Who? Jesus! Ah! 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 What? I hit space like I needed to do that. That's my fault. Oh, we still going? Uh, what's the other word? Blue? Oh my gosh, 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 oh my gosh. What? Still, oh God. Hey, 72% not bad. Okay, hold on, one more time, one more time, one more time, one more time. Look, bro getting scared of words. I'm not scared of words, I'm nervous because I don't remember what the word, okay, now I'm actually gonna, watch this, watch this. I'm nervous. Written laugh. Okay, that was better. That's all I wanted. That's all right. I still got a long shift. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna. You know. I'm gonna come back. Uh. Okay. That was type. What's browser? We gotta turn the sensitivity. I get, how's my pause out of battery? I'm not gonna lie, with this view? Shout out my nigga, I'm 
the job probably can't be that bad. As much as I wanted to leave, I need a cup of coffee. I, bro, I can't turn down the sensitivity. This is, this shit, I slightly move my mouth, mouse and my shit is going crazy, dude. What was I getting, water? I could use some water in real life though. Oh, coffee, okay. Yeah, let's get some coffee. Uh, there's cups right here. Get some coffee. Why would I throw it? It needed water, mouse DPI. Oh yeah, I could do that. Okay, this is better, this is better. Oh my gosh, thank you. It needed coffee? Oh, I don't drink coffee, so I don't know how this shit works. <sighs> Another day at the office. I hate this job and I hate my stupid manager. I'm so sick of Rebecca. I needed to put a lid on it. Yeah, Rebecca needs to put a lid on it. Am I right? It's no one's here. All right, if I was a lid, where would I be? I would assume next to everything else though, right? No. There we go. Ah, there we go. Mmm. Mmm. Zach with another five gifted subs. Oh, maybe it's true. Maybe I can actually be a streamer. Maybe I won't have to work this nine to five anymore. I'm done with it. So where's the restroom? PG's a copycat. PG saw that I was playing. He was like, I'm going to play. PG's a copycat. PG saw that I'm going to play, so he's going to play. PG's a copycat. He saw that I'm going to play. It's a door. Relax. Uh, This is the woman's bathroom. Uh, everyone's out the office. Oh my god, I'm a girl. Oh, I'm a girl. Oh my god. Squeeze. Squeeze the tip. Oh, wait, I'm a girl. That sounded like a guy. Look at this nigga's face, bro. I'm a I'm the only girl in the office using the bathroom. And this nigga walks up. <laughs> well, ma'am. Sorry I startled you. Well, ma'am, sorry. Didn't know anyone was in here. Almost gave me a heart attack, you sick son of a bitch. It's not okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. Should have knocked before I came in, but there there isn't usually anyone here this late. I noticed she didn't flush the toilet. Can I have a sniff? Huh? <laughs> No, it's fine. Just doing your no, 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 no. You need to learn that this isn't that this isn't right, bro. Yeah, you should have knocked, bro. Again, I'm sorry. I usually do knock, but I'm a little bit frustrated tonight. Must have slipped my mind. What has you frustrated? Someone keeps throwing coffee cups on the floor, all over the office. I'm done with it. It's been happening for weeks. Who would do that? Bro, just throw it, throw it in the trash. Yeah, that's really, that's, that's really rude. Well, I need to get back to it. Don't want to be here all night, picking up coffee cups. Have a good night, dude. <laughs> need any help with anything? I'm just about done with my rounds. Hey! Oh my god, some people are still here. I'm not alone. Oh my gosh. What do you want? I'm trying to get this done. I, I was just checking if you need anything. No, no, no. Sorry, sorry. I was checking if you needed anything. Something's wrong with this guy. Can't these clients ever make up their minds? Still working on that report? Harry Potter, come to die. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to get this done. Don't burn yourself out, man. You look like you're tweaking. You look stressed out. 
Whatever. Who else is here? Oh, I feel better knowing that I'm not alone and there's, you know, is at least someone else. Needed to book the cabin. Needed to book the cabin? Go ahead and pick this up. Go for Sydney Harper. Hey, Harp, it's Mike. Hey, Mike. <gasps> Mike? Mike? Mike the mod? <laughs> I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? Uh, yeah, my phone's been acting up lately. My battery dies at work. Yeah, my, my, my. <sighs> well, this seems like a lie. My battery dies at the, oh, no, no. I thought it said dies at work time. Yeah, my battery dies at the work time, uh, at the worst time. Oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh. Why would I ignore you? No. Uh, it even cut out on a client earlier. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um. All right. Uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. Uh, you know... Just more overtime. Damn, Harp, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Oh, thank you. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. Ah. And Nora. Who is Nora? I'm gonna go after work. No worries, Harper. I'm gonna I do it after work. I stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. All right, bet. Hey. Yeah? I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. He's trying to have intercourse. Ugh, work's been rough. I could use some dick. Great. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. All right. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. Yes? When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Got it, got Nora it. Nora and I were talking and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her okay i'll find something damn hang up is crazy i'll find something affordable it'll be just like the old college days you always had a knack for finding the best spot all right i should really make the bookings now right right of course sorry for yapping i'm just excited i guess all right talk to you later harp damn, harp harp kind of a bitch like damn say say bye some okay i don't think she likes this guy what if i type lake house or what was it oh, god this job seems boring what if i just screw up everything Seems good. <laughs> Reservation. Uh, what? Oh, yo. Oh my gosh. It automatically types it. That's actually crazy. <laughs> yo, what was in that coffee? No, no, no. Find your place to stay. Rent any cabin with, uh, from hosts around the world. Where are you going? Uh, let's see. Wi-Fi, garden, TV, kitchen, AC, parking space. Okay. This is nice. 350 at night, though. 
Uh, it looked nice though. I'm gonna think about it. Um, private room in nature. I do not like this. This shit got two stars too. I'm not getting that. Nigga, is this San Andreas? Hell no, them niggas be shooting out there, bro. I know that car. I know this car. Ain't this Ryder's car? That guy's a thug. Ooh, private cabin in Woodbury. Ooh, this looks nice. Three stars. Okay, okay, okay. Entire guest house. Mm -mm. Open villa. Wait, hold on. I'm literally sending myself a million dollars from the company. We're good, baby. It was over our budget. I mean, it looks it still looks nice, though. Three guests bedroom. I mean, three guests, two bathroom, two beds. Book it. Print that out. Hey, I'm assuming you get hundreds, if not thousands of stories sent daily. So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. I'm sorry if, if some of it's wit and weird, but I was rushed. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, clients meeting and trying to prove my worth. Which didn't leave me room for leisure, let alone a social life. Job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. I'm Sydney Harper, and this story takes place during one of those days. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend getaway to Royal Vermont. It sounded like a perfect break from the cycle of work, and my other friend, Nora, was quick to jump on board as well. The plan was simple. We rent a small cabin, close our shift early on Friday, leave and be back on Monday. Mike, Mike, Mike. came to pick me up. Pick me up. Two, Two days, days. Later. 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 What the hell are you looking? Why would I hang up? Why would not pick up? Pulling into the parking garage down. Uh, pulling into the parking garage now. You downstairs stairs yet? Uh, hi, Sydney. Thank you for booking my property in Woodbury for December 10th to 12th. I'm Rick, your host. Let me know if you have any questions and feel free to contact me for anything during your uh, during your day. Oh, I guess day. Yeah, I was about to say during your stay. Do you mean uh, looking forward to hosting you? Thanks, Rick. Thanks, Rick. We're looking forward to it. Just confirming the check in time was 3 p.m. Right? Yes, that's correct. The key will be in the lockbox by the front door. The code is 5176 5176. Call me if you have any trouble getting it open. Have a safe trip. Great. Thank you. 5176 5176. 5176. This isn't my car, is it? Is that him? Hey! You're you're him, right? Hey. This is awkward. That's still how you hug people? Why don't you hug me like you missed me? I ain't gonna lie, you a little... I ain't gonna lie, he got a little bit of like... 
You know, hold on, bro. Let me. <laughs> you look good. So do you, Mike. <laughs> you can just throw your stuff in the back and we'll get on your and we'll get on our way. All right, bet. Say that. Say that. All right, then. Are you ready to hit the road? Where's Nora? She'll meet us there. The route through the city would have been a detour for her anyway. All right, then, Harp. All right, let's go. Let's go. Can we listen to Christmas music? It's starting to snow. Or it was starting to snow. Oh, I'll do it. I got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh. That side profile was crazy. Uh, yeah. Mm. Harp, isn't it weird? We used to dream about escaping our college, and now here we are. Trying to escape from the life we wanted to live. We couldn't wait to get out to the real world. Maybe we just didn't know how much the real world would... You know, yeah, that's deep. Sucks sometimes. Yeah, it does. Change is just hard, like trying to adjust to a new job. Speaking of jobs, how's it going so far? We're working on this project that uses machine learning, uh, machine learning to predict, hold on, I got a text. Oh, I can't check it yet. That would, that would be rude anyway. Uh, it's pretty cutting edge stuff. Sounds like you're shaping the future and your job will be replaced. Not quite Tony Stark yet, but I'll take it. <laughs> I understood that reference. You thought I wouldn't because I'm a woman? What? Well, that's weird to park a school bus there. Anyway, uh, did you see that school bus? See what? There was a school bus back there by the old house. Maybe it's a project. Yeah, maybe the school bus is a project. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home on wheels or something. I've read people do that on the internet. Yeah, I've read that too, but I've never seen them use a school bus. Whatever, dude. That was actually a gift from my coworker, Rick. <laughs> Jesus! Oh, my God. oh, snap. Yeah, that, 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 that was close. You know? I read on the internet, maybe we look at the road. Thank you. I read on the internet that in Native American lore, seeing a deer cross your path is like getting a message from the universe. And what's the message? What exactly is the message, buddy? Can we turn on the radio or something? We wanted to escape our reality. How far is it now? Should be about an hour and a half from here. You know? Driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the intergalactic space. What do you mean? Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It's like the stars and galaxies rushing past us. That's deep. So you remember in the chat when I said I was 12? Oh, it's kind of beautiful. You've been skeeted in 4K. <laughs> I'm joking, it's a YouTuber thing. Okay, sorry. All right, let's <laughs> yeah. 5 14 p.m. Mm, pretty cozy. I love Christmas time, bro. Oh, Harp, check that out. A taxi cab. Moe's Pizza. Oh, I know that bus. Yeah, let's pull in. Let's pull in. Let's pull in. I know this bus. Oh my gosh. Let me get out. Oh my gosh. I could go for some pizza. You know, Harp, I gotta tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. Yeah. This pizzeria is exactly where my where it appeared on my GPS. Well, that's kind of the point. <laughs> it's like living in the future. <laughs> I'm so hungry, I think I could eat a whole pizza myself. Me too. Alright then, Harp. Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. Alright, let's go. Gosh, I'm gonna get pepperoni. I'm gonna get big slices. Oh, women never touch the door. Good boy. 
Yeah, I kind of need... Come on in. Thank you. What a gentleman. What a gentleman. Oops, is that my ass on your... This just in. Reports of a strong snowstorm coming towards Woodbury tonight. Residents are recommended to stay indoors and keep warm during this time. Let's check in with our field reporter. How's the weather out there, Phil? Oh, it's so cold out here. I, I can't feel my hands. Okay. Like, uh, the studio should have really brought some snow gear instead of buying that new coffee machine. I'm sure you'll be fine. You can have some coffee when you get back to the studio. Jerry, you cannot be serious. You know my doctor Ooh. said not to drink any caffeine. Sounds like someone's having a bad day. Maybe you should <laughs> cool off. You little shit. Why can't you go out here and deal with the snow instead of me? I've been working here for six years, and I never get to report somewhere nice. Listen, Phil, I'm just clearly the better looking one. You can worry about where you'll report once you get that rhinoplasty. A rhinoplasty? Why would I need rhinoplasty? My face looks perfectly fine. You could also use some Botox while you're at it. Actually, maybe you should just work as a studio light engineer behind the camera. I think it would be better field of work for you. You only got your job because your sister works at the mixing board. You would have never been able to work here if it wasn't for her. I'd like to see you work the ENG sometime. How dare you? I'm a certified <laughs> news anchor. Certified? Yeah, my ass, okay? You didn't do shit. How about I come by the studio and we settle this like men? Oh, yeah? Well, let's do it, punk. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Yo! Right. Chad, that was, Is your that was nine to five Take a vacation with rentacabin.com. We offer thousands Chat. of cabins readily available and accessible. Wait, Chad, wait. My debut as a voice actor. Hey. I did it. My debut as a voice actor. <laughs> I did it. I'm a voice actor. I'm so proud of you. I'm number one. You did good. You see, you, the, oh my God, you even pronounced rhinoplasty right? Thank you. You're welcome. All right, let me go. CC clap, CC clap, CC clap. How's the pizza, guys? How's your day going? Who are you? I'm Sydney, bitch. Look, Sydney. How about look at your face? That shit leaning to the right. I'm really about to get on your ass. We're just here to enjoy our pizza in peace. Thank you for understanding. I hope you enjoy your meal. What's everybody else talking about? Hey, how's the pizza? The pizza is great, actually. I think Moe's might have ruined other pizzas for us. Mmm. It's our first time in the area. Oh, wait, did I just say that? Oh, yeah, I thought I was about to say. Where are you headed? We're on our way to a conference in the next town over with my buddy here. Hey, what's up, man? A man of few words. We just stop to eat whenever a place looks interesting. But yeah, this place definitely has cozy vibes. Best decision of the trip so far. Hell yeah. How about you? Local or just passing through? I'm just passing through, man. Just passing through. I'm not going to tell you exactly where I'm going because that's stupid. Interesting. What? Yeah. Mmm. Better get back to this pizza. You have a safe trip and be careful. Be care in the snow and be care in the snow. I think you mean be careful <laughs> in the snow. What's in that pizza? <laughs> All right, enjoy the pizza. I mean, oh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cut in line. Evening, folks. Looks like the colds got everyone craving pizza tonight. Yeah, dude, just put the pizza in the box, okay? Uh, you fine folks know what, what you want to eat. Well, uh, get three slices of uh, stupid apple. Um, I'll go with pepperoni, cheese, and veggie. And a veggie. Okay, okay. Pepperoni, cheese, and a veggie. And for you, miss, I want the mo. No, I just want pe pepperoni. Because most special is probably some crazy shit. Just give me some pepperoni, please. All right. What's your second slice? You know what? Give me the most special. The third? Cheese. Any drinks for you folks? Please. That should cover us just the pizza today. Thanks. Dude, no Bev is crazy. All right, then. Six hot slices coming right up. That'll be $22.50. Don't forget the Bev. Uh, yo, no Bev is kind of crazy. Oh, shit. Thank you. Uh, your order number is 27. 
Just grab a seat and we'll call you when your pizza's ready. All right, thank you. Uh, what's this guy's story? How you doing, my friend? Not bad, you. I'm as good as a man can be, my friend. Are you here for pizza? No. Just looking for a little help. Maybe I can help you. Maybe you can. But you go on and get some pizza first, eh? Maybe we'll catch up later. All right. Did you see this guy? Looney. A loony baboony. Sorry, thought it was my pizza. When's my order gonna be ready, dude? Do you have any recommendations? Get the cheese. Just the cheese. I'll sit down. Oh, the smelling the pizza. I was about to say, yo, what the? F Smells so good in here. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, smells good. Oh, one second. Uh, stop. We're on the road, Nora. Let's get... Let's, uh... Let us know when you get going. Uh, sorry, guys. Nora, please be careful. I hate that you're leaving so late. Drive slow. Don't worry. I'll make sure Harp stays up to let you in. Wait, wait. Oh, you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not gonna bore you with all of the details. The long and short of it is one of my clients needs a last minute change. Their payments are about the only- Wait, ain't this a, another streamer? Lily. This is a voice that you just know. Only thing keeping the lights on. I hate to leave so late, but I gotta keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it and be on my way. Again? Are you streaming again? <laughs> Bet you streaming again? <laughs> Are you streaming again? Nora's gonna be late. Did you listen to Nora's voice message in the group? Yeah, I just saw it. Looks like she'll be late. That's a bummer. I guess we'll have to start the fun without her. <laughs> no, I'm so ugly. Like, yo, he's Scott Lee, bro. Can you make it any more obvious? What can we do? Am I on freaking type freaky timing too? <laughs> what can we do? Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. Yo! I wasn't looking at order number 27. You or your folks are right here. I'll be back. I'm going to go. All right. Thank you, sir. All right, you folks all set. Thank you. Da, 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 da. I got my pizza. I'm about to do pizza. Oh my God, the pepperoni love us. And mm. Oh damn, this pizza slaps. You're one of those guys, huh? You're one of those guys, huh? Can't believe Nora is missing out on this bomb ass pizza. Good thing Phantom's not here, so we don't get Phantom taxed. Like, I feel like that's how you. I feel like that's his vibe. <laughs> I know, right? I'll take another bite of this. Mm, 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 my oh god! Oh god! I gotta eat the crust. Oh, I gotta eat the crust on this. Mm. Ah! Damn, Harvey, you actually ate the crust? Uh, it's kind of wasteful night not to, don't you think? I'll eat a tire if, it, if I was hungry. I'd eat a tire if I was hungry enough. Fair enough. But eat something else. Uh, uh, eat someone else's tires. We still got a bit of driving to do. <laughs> You're a hoot, dude. You're a hoot. Gonna bust down on this cheese. Mm, 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 oh, god damn. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, bit my tongue. Fuck. Mm, mm. Oh, fuck, I gotta eat the crust. Mm, 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 Oh, God. Yo! Hey there, my friends. 
Hello there. I saw y'all pull pull in driving that nice old truck. Are you just watching who pulls in and taking notes? Not at all, my friend. I just noticed you seem to be heading the same direction I was. Y'all mind if I hitch a ride with you? Where's your car? I mean, that's a stupid question. Look at, like, where are you headed? Just headed where the road takes me. I'm a bit of an adventurer. Just hiking the trails and seeing the country. So what do y'all say? Care to give this free spirit a ride down that snowy road? I'm not sure, bruh. Surely you can find just a little bit of room for me. I can ride in the middle. Hell, I'll even ride in the bed. It's, it's my, it's my friend's car. I'm sorry, I, I can't. Please take the hint, dude. Please take the hint. You gotta be shitting me, lady. No space. I know there's a middle seat. You scared me or something? I'm sorry. You ain't too kind, are you? Unkind people meet unkindness themselves. You best be careful out there. Yeah, stand up for it. Like, help me, bruh. You the man. No, no, no. Y'all got me all wrong. Sorry, I just... I'm just cold and tired is all. Yeah, thanks. Well, that was weird. Yeah, and you a bitch. You ain't press him or nothing. He didn't even order anything. I feel bad for the guy, though. No, I don't. You've been hiking all this time, bro. Why wouldn't we pull in? There's two other people that pulled in before us. Why you ain't ask them? Get on the RV. Get It's a bus right there. Get on the bus, bro. Freaky ass niggas need to stay their ass aside, right? Oh, oh, oh. Is that mushroom? Oh. Yeah, Holy, that was good. All right. All right, then. Are you uh, ready to hit the road? Maybe we can uh, beat the worst of the snow. Yo, dude, can you? Yo, hello? Excuse me. We having a conversation, my brother. He's touching my breast. Uh, Are we close? Let's see. If my GPS is right, it should be another hour. Back. Give me the keys. He just grabbed my ass. Harp, the weather is awful. Why don't you drive uh, part of the way home? I'm going to drive so you can get a break. I'm afraid of what kind of break you're going to give me, Harp. Can you give me the key so we can go? This dude is like being weird. Fine, but there's one condition. What is it? I get the first choice of bedrooms when or if we get there. Deal. Give me these keys. All right, bro. All right, take care, man. Take care, brother. Watch out. Move. Take care, my dude. Five forty-nine p.m. Good evening, Vermont. This is your host on WKWB, your hometown station, bringing you the best tunes to warm your hearts on this chilly night. As we embrace the first snowfall of the season, there's nothing like a perfect song to set the mood. So here's a track that'll make you feel right at home. Coming up next, Be Sincere by Ed and Altus. Stay warm and stay tuned. Thank you. You love Sorry. Don't look at me like that, bro. Talk about was one right here. We're going to be here a hundred years, so let's appear online. What is happening? Wait! I don't know where I'm going, but I'm here. We're we're fine. This should be it. We're good. Yo, this guy's going to piss me off. Uh, I thought you were just going to keep driving there. Yeah, okay. Okay. Can we get out? Let's Are we getting out? Let's go. What are we waiting for? I'm waiting for you. Let's go. Babe, 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 babe. All this space. All this space. Drive around. Drive around. 
Keep even the horn, buddy. It's not going anywhere. You're mad. You're mad. What was it? Five, uh... Five, one, seven, six. Um, I could have parked Mike's truck there. Oh, they want me to fix. I have to fix my car. Okay. Roll your window down. Roll your window down. Should have hit his ass. I thought that was like the security code. Okay, can we? No! Can you back up, you freak? What a great place. I knew I could count on you. It smells so nice in here. All right, but we really need to hit the, I really need to hit the John. Take your time. While I'm gone, can you put these groceries away? Should be enough space in the fridge. The house was cozy and well furnished. Cozy is with a Z though, right? <laughs> That's a shower. Ah! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm sweating. Sorry about that. Are, are, are you okay? Long drive and all that pizza really did a number on me. No, no worries, man. I got all the groceries um put away. Thanks for handling that harp. Anyway, this place looks crazy nice. It's got that rustic charm you just don't see anymore. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's cute. Uh, it's nice to get away from the city for a bit. Hang on. I really, I, I really need to be. Damn, why you gotta pee so much? Like, can we? Hold on. For sure. Hey, I really need to pee. I'll be back. Yeah, go ahead. I'll start unpacking our bags. Thanks, dude. Thanks, bro. I really do appreciate you. I, re I really do appreciate you, man. Close the door just because you never know. The smell alone told me the pizza had really done a number on Mike. Oh my God, he shit. Are you gonna use the bathroom? Okay, please confirm when you text in uh, or when you check in. Say what chef. We checked in. My hands. Mike. 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 Uh, you feeling any better after the drive? Um, I'm good. Want to check the house? Sounds good to me. Let's see what this place has to offer. After you. Jesus Christ, dude. Oh, yeah, sure. Well, let's look at the living room. You're not really looking at the house. You're just, okay. It's over here. Oh, we got a nice little, uh, this living room is bigger than my apartment. Back Let's look at the backyard real quick, bro. Let's look at the backyard real quick. I'm getting really cold. Yeah, me too. So why are there footprints coming from this gate over here? Oh, this opens. Why would, why would this open? What do we need to come over here for? Why is there gap? gas here been a while since i went fishing yeah me too yeah let's get back in the house bro if this goes in we have hot steamy sex on the couch right now oh i missed it's weird okay little little closet They can't keep getting away with this. Why are you even still here? That's not how this shit works. Oh, hey, you're still here. You scared us. Oopsie days. I didn't mean to. Welcome to my home, sweet home. What a lovely young couple. Oh, no, no, no. We're not a couple. Well, you didn't have to put it like that. 
<laughs> I knew you was. Look at your face. It's just uh, like you didn't even need to say anything. I was just answering his question. He didn't ask a question, Sydney. He made a statement, and you. <laughs> Never mind. Oopsie daisy, silly me. Didn't mean to cause a stir with you two. <laughs> didn't expect anyone to be here. Why are you so close? Back up. Oh, um. I was out looking for my cat earlier, and I remembered the TV has been on the fritz here. Just thought I'd stop by and try to uh, uh, get it working again, since the last few folks left a bad word for it. You know, they say treat your quest like your guests. Sorry, your guests like family. My family doesn't go without a TV. <laughs> you smell really nice, young lady. <laughs> what? Speaking of that, now that you folks are here. Let me show you around my sweet home. Right now, I literally just looked around. I'd be a bad owner if I did give you the grand tour. <laughs> Joe, can we? I'm turning this TV off. Jesus Christ! Host was a middle-aged man with a ner with a nervous energy. Well, this here's our bathroom. Comes with a toilet. And tissue. That ticking sound you hear is a clock. Not just any clock, a grandfather clock with special powers. It can possess the mind and will make you do anything I will. You don't even understand that you're in a trance right now. Take two steps forward. Yeah, that's right. Why don't you step a little closer? Here's your shower. That thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in the Amazon jungle. Oh, uh, this sink doesn't work, unfortunately. Not to worry. I'll get it fixed for you real soon. Let me show you the other bedrooms now. Look, Harp, this room has a nice ass view. Can you just stop? Just stop. You think that's nice, mister? Wait till I show you the deck. Follow me now, please. You should be a, yeah, go ahead. You go, I'll follow. Just in case, just never know. Oh, this is nice. Holy smokes, this is incredible. Incredibly cold. Glad you folks like it. This is one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. It's a great spot for fishing too. All right, folks, let's head back before I catch a cold here. Again. I can never make you my man. You don't got that backbone in you, bro. You, you, you what? Uh oh. There's that ticking again. Why don't you get on your knees? No, no, no. Get on your knees. Don't be shy. There you go. Why don't you crawl forward? Crawl forward to me. A little closer. I'm gonna show you something. Here's the storage room. If you need anything, tools, extra blankets, whatnot, it's all in here. If the power ever goes out, you can use this flashlight here on my right. Storms like these, you never know. Ah, we might not need it. Trust me, it's always best to know where your light is. All right, folks, let's head downstairs now. Why am I on my knees? That was weird. God, you go first. What is, what? this nigga always wanna look at me? Just walk, bro. You like food? Why don't you kiss your, kiss your boyfriend? Yeah, go up to him, kiss him, give him a kiss. Yeah. Oh, 
Alrighty, folks. I see you're already sh uh, stocked up the fridge with some tasty food. See the knob? Turn the knob up uh, uh, for more cooling and down to cool it off. I tend to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you folks the water heater. Can you stop doing that? Every time, just walking, this nigga like, you alright, buddy? Everything good? You straight? No, I fool with you, right? Like, just keep walking, bro. The nigga was walking down the stairs like this. You alright? <laughs> you alright, buddy? <laughs> nigga ain't even look back. No access to gas. Hey, what's in that room? Oh, nothing to worry about down here. Just the water heater. Some old storage stuff. <laughs> if it ever stops working, just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire right up. You'll be back in business. That's it? Well, what about the room? What about this locked room here? Hey, sir. What's the deal with that room over there? Uh -huh. Stupid ass. Lame man. Lame man. Nothing you two need to concern yourselves with. I kinda use this basement as storage. Renters don't need the space. They really ought to keep upstairs. If you catch my drift. Okay, well, I was just curious. Let's move on, dude. Go. You all right, buddy? You good? You know, I fought with you. Go! What the hell is wrong with y'all? Did I mention? Well, no. Maybe I ought to keep it to myself. <laughs> The fella I bought this house from, well, told me his mother died down here. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night. Said they could hear something shuffling around down here. Now you tell me? Not to scare y'all folks, but if I were you, I wouldn't really step down here. Ugly. <laughs> the looks on your face. <laughs> Come on now, I'm just joking. Smile once in a while. It's just a little joke. We don't like to laugh anymore. <laughs> At this point, my creep meter was qu quietly pinging me at around six, six out of ten. Six out of ten. This is kind of creepy. My creepy meter is telling me this guy's a weirdo. Alrighty, folks. Snow's starting to pick up. I'm gonna hit the road now. Gotta find that damn cat. <laughs> if you catch my drift. Thanks for showing us around. Oh, uh, by the way. What was the name on the booking? I must be getting old. It's Sydney. Ha! <laughs> Sydney, that's right. That's right. A pretty name for a pretty lady. Go lock the door. Is it just me or is that dude super weird? Yeah, very weird. Go lock the door. Anyway, let's go see if there's anything good on TV. <laughs> I hate you. I'm gonna take a shower. Cool, I'll find something to watch while you're in there. <laughs> Let me know if it feels like you're under a waterfall. You are not a man. What a weird guy. Thanks, see you in, the, see you in a bit. I don't think you two are too far from each other. I think you two are, you know, literally not too far from each other. Um, I'm not taking a shower in here, am I? 
I was keen to taking showers upstairs. I was about to say, we who takes showers on the first floor? That is kind of crazy. This is a nice shower. Damn, bro, Sydney slamming shit for what? I'm fully clothed, by the way, so this is kind of, yeah, it's kind of awkward. Yo, jump scare. He's gonna be here. He's gonna be here. He's gonna be here. He's gonna be here. He's gonna he's gonna he's gonna be here. Jump scare coming, jump scare coming, jump scare coming. Go jump scare coming around the corner. Jump scare coming around the corner. Jump scare, jump scare, jump scare, jump scare around the corner. Oh, what's that? That door just opened. Why? What the what is wrong with you? Hard right, check this out. I find a fishing rod in the shed. Now I'm gonna eerily walk up to you with it. Like it's Sephiroth of sword. Like I hate this guy. I absolutely hate this guy. Planning to catch a dinner. Now that you've mentioned it, that would be pretty, a pretty epic addiction, uh, addition, sorry, to the trip. All right, you know what? Let's do it. Hell yeah, follow me. There's another rod in the shed. We could both give it a try. Oh my God, I don't, I do not like this dude. I do not like this dude. I don't like him. I just don't like him. I don't like him. I don't like him. I don't trust him. I don't like him. I don't like him. I don't like him. I don't want to be here. Where is Nora? Where is Nora? I don't like him. I don't like him. I really like it, buddy. <laughs> do you want to grab the other fishing rod, Harper? Yeah, yeah, just give me a second. Wish I had a gun. Oh snap, I saw a killer recipe for bait carp. We'll need to catch three carp. Though, you up for the challenge? Yeah. Uh, I need a gun. Well, first things first, we need the right bait for, for the carp. Check out the bait information board. I need a gun. I want a gun. Don't like this dude. Don't trust them, no. Two in a chest, two in a head. Watch him bleed. Two in a chest, two in a head. Watch him bleed. Let me grab the bait. I just sell my fate. I'm gonna die today, gonna die today. Let me grab this bait. I just sell my fate. Gonna die today. Maggie bait, uh. Maggie bait, uh. Better than dead, uh. Bet I'm dead, uh. Tell my mama, uh. Tell my daddy, uh. That I love him so much. I was happy, uh. I was happy, uh. Yeah, I was a happy one. Then I got my nine to five. Then I lost my happiness, uh. Lost my happiness. Now I'm really trapped in shit, uh. Old oh, man told me nigga died in basement, uh. All alone with this creepy ass nigga In the shed with this nigga Look at that sweater, who dressed like that? Look at that sweater, who dressed like that? That nigga here, that nigga here That nigga ugly as hell, I cannot stand it Oh, oh no, oh no no, can't stand it, nigga, no. Can't stand it, nigga, no. Not to that lake I go. Not to that lake I go. I think I saw my soul. I think I saw my soul. Mama, I must go. I must go home, must go home, I saw my soul. Drifting down this lake of mine, drifting down this lake of mine, I just saw that fate of mine, I just saw that fate of mine. Drifting down this lake of mine, drifting down this lake of mine. 
Now up I, now up I, up I Go Go I lost my soul Can we close? I wish we can close this. I don't want to see out there, bro. While I'm cleaning the fish, do you mind prepping the, m the, the marinade? Just take a bowl and throw it, throw in ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper, salt, Italian seasoning, paprika, and yogurt. Okay, salt, black pepper, paprika, Italian seasoning, ginger garlic. Okay, what's this? We got some black pepper, boom, boom, boom. We got some salt, boom, boom, boom. We got some uh, cornflakes. We got some, uh, we got some, uh, what's this? Some ginger, boom, boom, boom. We got some uh, some Italian seasoning, boom, boom, boom. We got some uh, re paprika, boom, boom, boom. We got some, uh, we got some, uh, we got some, uh, we got some uh, frozen yogurt. Nope. Um, we got some uh, olive oil yogurt. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Yogurt is a yes. Got some yogurt and olive oil. Olive, olive, olive oil. Where is the olive oil? If I was olive oil, where would I be? I found it. Do you mind throwing the fish in the in the in the marinade in the in the in the, in the casserole while uh, while I chop the fish? Yeah, 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 I got you, I got you. Uh, throw it, throw it. Uh, where? Um, of course. Oh no, I had to add the fish first. There we go, mar marinade, marinade, and now we need the veggies. Uh, now could you get the now could you add the veggies? I read that this needs to go in 3400, 3400, 3400, 3400, 3400, 3400, 30. These carbs are gonna taste amazing. Why'd you step away like you were leaving me? While we wait for it to cook, how about we play some board games also? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. We can do that. As long as we stay together. I'll grab whatever catches your eyes. Can't wait to see you pick. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, let me see. Can I? I'm gonna just come with you. What if I just come with you? Why don't we just go together? I need to do this. They want me to grab this, and then I'm gonna turn around, and then it's gonna be a jump scare. So, first things first, we not doing no Ouija board. Because I'm just... No, we're not doing that. Uh, we not playing no whispers in the dark. We not doing mega rounds because that's just not happening tonight. Uh, snakes and ladders. No, I don't fuck with snakes. Um, Catopoly. Don't even know what that is because that show ain't Monopoly. But there's one thing I could do is bust in the gas on some Jenga. Come on, we doing Jenga. Put a blah like a Jenga. Way, way, way. I spin a blah like a Jenga. When I drive a song, you know that it's a banger. I'm a star, I almost fucked up. I'm a star, but I got that good love. Oh my god. I can't even drag my mouse. 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 My mouse is nowhere to be found. My mouse nowhere to be found. I think I broke the game down. I think I broke the game down. I fucked up the game because of my fear. I really feel some fucking tears. What's that in the chandelier? The chandelier. Can we start the game? I can't drag my mouse, I'm in pain. Fuck the comments, yeah. Oh, fuck the game in it. Oh, fuck the comments, yeah. Oh, fuck the game in it. Bro is cheating. Yeah! That was a fun game, Harp. You did really well. I I enjoyed myself, Mike. I'm not gonna lie, I enjoyed myself. All right, the carp should be uh, just about done. Let's grab some plates, I'm starving. I almost forgot we had food in the oven. Asparagus chocolate cake with a spoonful of mayonnaise. You know who that is? This delicacy is very popular in <laughs> where mayonnaise flows down the rivers like a mayonnaise water park. So first, we are going to prepare the asparagus. Season these with a lot of salt. Salt is good for the bones. After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start making the chocolate. Take a couple cocoa beans. <laughs> uh, 
Ew! Yes, the cocoa beans need to be blended into the sauce with a little bit of vinegar. Gotta keep that fancy flavor in there. The next thing we prepare is the mayonnaise. We stir fry this in a pan with Irish tofu. I'm not gonna lie. This is gonna taste like shit. <laughs> but here you are anyway, listening to my cooking instructions. This is the breen of the mayonnaise. We, we gotta inject it with a little anesthesia to make sure it doesn't revolt against us. It gets very angry once it knows we're trying to cook it. After Ew. doing that, we mix all the ingredients together in Time a tray to cook it. and place it inside the oven. Okay, and while that's cooking, we can start on the appetizer. Gasoline-soaked ramen. Now, this dish is extremely hard to make. A dish only for experienced cooks. It requires a lot of patience. I should probably get my food, huh? What you will need is gasoline and ramen. This dish really soothes the soul. Almost like a cayenne cleanse. We begin by pouring the gasoline. Into okay, this why is this so creepy? Why is this so creepy? Sure to use whole gasoline since it's really bad for or half and half. Do not use diesel. So after letting the gasoline come to a boil, we can put <laughs> in our ramen. I'm using some stuff I found in my grandmama's basement. But you can use whatever kind you like. This ramen will taste fantastic once the gasoline fully soaks into the noodles. It's actually kind of scientific. Bill Nye who? The gasoline <laughs> molecules merge with the noodle molecules and they taste very good. Now that this is cooking, we can check on our cake. Um, uh, if your oven <clears throat> catches on fire, uh, make sure to put it out with the fire extinguisher. Well, damn. Uh, uh <laughs> damn, that's burnt. Uh, I I'm not eating this. <laughs> But, but, but not to worry. <laughs> I know someone who will. <laughs> Yo, Grandma! <laughs> Yo, I made you food! No, 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 it's not, it's not poison. It's not poison. Look. <laughs> Goodbye, Grandma. And stay in your room. I don't want you watering around the house again. Get back in there! Okay, I'm glad she ate that up. I wouldn't want any food to go to waste. Anyways, I guess we can still enjoy our gasoline ramen, which is ready to serve. I hope y'all enjoy eating this as much as I will. Let's eat! That was a good episode, dude. That was a, you haven't touched your food. Who waits until after the video's over to start eating? Or you gotta eat while you're watching the video, bro, like this. You ain't never watched? Yeah, you not a real, you know. Oh, I was done. Well, that was good. Heard that was some damn fine food. Twice as good since we caught the fish ourselves. Yeah, it was, it was good. It was really good. We make a great team, Harp. Yo, you, the, oh my God, you're so thirsty, dude. You're so desperate. It's actually embarrassing. I need to check my emails real quick. Left my laptop upstairs. Thought we were gonna take a break from work. It's not work. I'm just waiting on my shipment details for my UDS. I'll be right back. All right, I'll clean up here. Oh, no. Guess I'll... Oh, God.
He's gonna jump scare me. Yo, chat, mama, is this almost finished? All right, I'm ending. I'm ending. Another unfinished game. I'm gonna finish the game, it's short. I just can't do this. <sighs> what the hell, Mike? Yeah, no, I'm definitely, I don't like you, dude. That's not cool, bro. That's not funny. How about a game of hide and seek? No! I'm not playing this. I'm not chat. I, I, I'm telling you, I'm not. I can't do this, bro. I decided to hide in the basement. The one place where he said not to go. I can't do this shit, bro. This is so dumb. You're so stupid. I decided to hide in the nook under the stairs. Like, you're so stupid, bro. Where's the stairs, dude? This is so stupid. Oh, great. Now I, ah, okay, yeah. Good, cool, we're good. Because I definitely... I got a headache, bro. You got me! That wasn't even a challenge. I required it in the sense. Bro, I'm not even. I don't. <sighs> I'm just hitting this nigga with periods, bro. My turn to hide now. You better close your eyes and start counting. One Mississippi. Two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi. Obviously, I found you. Maybe next time, turn the light off and I I, I won't see you, you know? Uh -huh. Hang on, Harp. I think I heard something upstairs. We are upstairs, dude. You're gonna try this again? No kidding, Sydney. I really heard something, um... No. 
I swear on my life I heard something. Go check it out, dude. I see this attic access door here. Oh my. Why are you walking out so I go? Why'd you close the door? You weirdo? The hell was that about? Ugly ass stance. I need a step stool. Where's one at? You're weird. You're a weirdo. You're a weirdo. Stop doing that, bruh. It's the cat. It's the cat. I'm not even scared. It's the cat. Oh, you said I knew it was the cat. I knew it was the cat. I knew it was the fucking stupid, stupid pussy cat. I knew it was a cat. I knew it was a cat. I knew it was a stupid, stupid, stupid pussy cat. The cat goes meow. The cat goes meow. Meow, 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 meow. If I kill you right now, and no one knows, is it really a murder? There's a cat. It was just a cat. It was the cat he was looking for. I think she was hungry. Maybe we can give her one of uh, the carps. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. True, true. Wait, why are we still playing? Can we? I decided to hide in the tool shed in the backyard. Oh, yeah. So we're just brain dead. We're just brain. We're just a brain dead character. Like, I, I don't know. This this game is so stupid i i just I, I don't even like it bro i don't even i don't want it i don't even want don't even put my credits on it i don't want i don't want nothing I, I hate i hate this i hate this this is so stupid this is actually stupid it's dumb i don't like it why are we doing this are we serious right now the lady who submitted this story if, if based on the true story or whatever should have never did that shit. okay it makes you look like a dumbass are you slow like what's wrong with you well I'm in the shed. You found me! Ah, uh, you got me, rats. Damn, Harp took me a while to figure out you left the house. Anything worth doing is worth doing well, I always say. My turn, close those pretty eyes now. Yo, I'm getting tired, this is boring. Look, I'll hide in the house. We're headed back anyway. You'll find me and we'll go to bed. Bro, yo, chat. I, I can't. Like, I just want to. I don't want to. And I get, guess what? I can't go back into the, the house to count. Watch, 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 watch. They don't let me go any further, chat. Now, how stupid is that? How stupid is that? How stupid is that? Mississippi. Nine, Mississippi. I got a gun. 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 And it's loaded. I got a gun. Up the pole, bitch. I got a gun. Got a gun. Got a gun. And a gun. Got a gun. And it's loaded. I got a gun out the pole. I got a motherfucking gun. I got a motherfucking gun. Ah! Ah! If I punch you in the face, are you gonna cry about it? If I punch you in the face, are you gonna cry about it? If I strangle you right now, will you cry? If I killed you here right now, would you die? Are you gonna die? 
Do you wanna die? Do you wanna die? Do you wanna die? Cause I wanna kill you right now! Cause I wanna kill you right now! You're weird! Weird! Weird as fuck! Says you're weird! Weird! Weird as fuck! Well, hey there. Why are you back again? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? You should have told us, weirdo. Miss, this is my house. I don't need to check in with you every time I fix something silly. Yeah, press his ass, man. He ain't never seen my man say he never seen he ain't never seen nobody fix a faucet with a hammer before. You ever fix many faucets yourself, young man? Didn't think so. So I'd imagine you don't know what tools you'd need. How long have you been here? Just got here a couple minutes ago. Saw y'all was playing little. Hide and go find a person or something like that. If you heard anything before that, it must have been that old lady. Remember? <laughs> Yo, you think you can fix this tomorrow, bro? You asking me to leave, miss? It's not too kind of you. <sighs> She's being polite. We rented this. Okay, hold on, hold on. We rented this house and would like to have it to ourselves. I, we don't really want to have to call law enforcement. So you couldn't hold that for yourself? You threw me in the, yo, you're really pussy, bro. You're really pussy. No, I don't want to, we don't want to have to call the authorities. Yo, Mike, please let me handle this. No, step back. Let it, he want to be the big back. I ain't saying shit. Mm. <laughs> ain't no cops in Woodbury, son. You think they're gonna arrest the homeowner for fixing the faucet? I was just doing some work. If you can't handle that, it's your problem, not mine. You know what? You folks don't like me fixing the faucets. I'll leave it to you. Escort him out, bro. And don't look back, bro. Just keep your eyes on him, bro. Lock the door. After locking the door, we debated what to do. Y'all are idiots. If y'all literally stay the night there, if you don't get in your working car and just leave, bro, call it a day and drive back home. After locking the door, we debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. Yeah, all right. I hope you die. I hope, I hope, I hope the worst. We attributed his behavior to an extreme lack of social awareness. Yeah, y'all are y'all are actually idiots. Actually, it's look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves. Mike said, who could barely stand up for himself, and his voice shakes whenever he tries to confront anybody. But by this time, I was feeling really tired. I decided to get some rest. All right, dude. Yeah, all right, whatever. Just do it. Whatever's gonna happen, just do it. Do it at this point. I don't care. Look at me. Look at me not caring. Oh, someone's at the door. Oh, yeah. Let me go. Who is it? Hey, what up? Kill me. Why are you? Oh, my God. I swear. If I could reach through this monitor <laughs> and punch you in your in your face. Harper, are you still awake? Now I am. Now that you knocked on the door. Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. Let me guess. You heard a sound. But instead of being a man, you came to check on. You came to ask mommy if you could go check out the loud noise for you, huh? Do you mind if I come in? I'd like to talk about something. Oh yeah, sure. 
I hope it's about what we are. I hope it's about what we are. Oh, I've been waiting for it. Let me close the door. Actually, what? The storm's starting to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. Yeah, I hope Nora's okay. She'll be just fine. Sydney, don't worry. I'm here to keep you safe. Okay, what? Hey, it's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch over people they care about, right? Yeah, and so far, mm, you really haven't been doing that. What are you talking about? What a day, huh? This wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. Yeah, it's been a strange day. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. He does own the place, dumbass. You know exactly what I meant, Sydney. He shouldn't just barge in the place whenever he wants. We rented the damn house. Yeah, where was that energy when he was standing right in front of our face? I mean, the guy's probably harmless, but I'm frustrated. I mean, you've all, you also been a little difficult to deal with, too. You're right, Sydney. I'm really sorry. Bro, let's just get some sleep, bro. Get off of me! Yo, no, I go to sleep in your room. You go to sleep in your room. No, I go to sleep in my room. You go to sleep in your room. Why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? What? I'm not interested and I don't consent. Heavy on the don't consent. Harp, you know? I've missed this. Us just talking. It's been too long. I don't like you like that, you know? You don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. Where is this coming from? You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon. I remember it being pretty awkward, kind of like how it is now. It didn't start out awkward, though. Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happen. I was drunk. Look at you. Look at your face. It looks the same way when I was drunk. And I'm fucking sober right now, bro. Something's wrong with you. I'm not interested. I'm not attracted to you. Sexually or even like, like in a friend way. I don't even like you as a friend. You know how they say opposites attract? I don't know where the fuck they got that from. They sure did. I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. Oh, let me check my phone, bro. Well, I can't check. My, well, uh, I don't know. I, I guess I've been meaning to talk to you about that. Oh, Mike. I don't know. I don't know what to say. No, no, no. I've been meaning to talk to you about that. I didn't like it. You just let me worry about the details, Sydney. Mike, I don't think this is a good time. I said it. I don't think this is a good time. What's going on? Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury, and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing, and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. There's a sign by the side of the road. It's hard to see. I, I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half of a deep, and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me?
All right, come on. Let's go. Let's go get her. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. This is awkward. This it's been awkward with us. Let's just let's just go get her. Uh, what a timing, huh? But I guess we can't leave Nora stranded. Yeah, let me get dressed and I'll meet you downstairs. No, Sydney. You stay here and get some sleep. There's no sense in both of us freezing our asses off. No. How come there's not an option for no? You're in pajamas and I'm still dressed. You just settle in and I'll help Nora. I always like doing nice things for you, Sydney. This can't be life. This can't be, this, this can't be life, bro. We'll finish talking about this later, okay? Get some good rest and stay warm. We really feel like we have to. Yeah, I'm just put. I don't want to talk to you, bro. I got nothing to say, bro. Couldn't go to bed without locking the front door. Damn, nigga left quick. Damn, you can't wait to leave, huh? Hey, why don't you get some rest while I'm gone? Are you sure it's safe to drive? Don't worry, I've driven in worse. Besides, Nora's probably freaking out more than you right now. Yeah, you're probably right. Look, make sure you take care of yourself, all right? Lock the doors. Before I go, how about a hug? I mean, just in case you're asleep when I get back, I kind of need one right now. No. Not now, Mike. Sweet dreams. Get some sleep, Sydney. I told myself things would get better if I just get some rest. Nora always knew how to cheer me up and I needed it uh, more by the minute. With her arriving soon, I decided to rest in the meantime. Ooh, 12.39 a.m. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna think optimistically. That must be Nora and him. Let me go down and open the door for Nora and him. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad you guys are back. I'm so confident that I'm not even gonna look through the, through the. Huh, just finished applying my cream for my uh, herpes. Oh, hello, was there someone at the door? Look, friend. I know it ain't ideal banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was counting on a ride from some friends, but they're running behind and won't be here for about two more hours. So can I come in and maybe drink some coffee and watch some Berlizzi? Uh, you can you can sit on the porch. Yeah, you can sit on the porch, bro. You can sit on the porch, bro. Thanks. Uh, but I was hoping you let me wait inside until my friends get here to get me. You not coming in, bro. Are you fucking kidding me? You're gonna let me freeze to death out here? Yo. Nigga, I ain't make you go hitchhiking in the desk. Now, that's the smartest thing you said all night. Bitch, I ain't make you go out the house, pack all your bags, and walk around. I should have known you'd be as big of a bitch here as you were back at the pizza joint. What? <laughs> huh? You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek earlier? I knew I seen this. I knew I seen him. I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but it looks like you're still a bitch. Unkind. Ooh, even harder. Yo, get out or I'll call the cops. Please just leave Rocket. Please. Yo, get out or I'll call the cops. How about that? Ain't no cops around here. Speaking of, I don't see your fella truck out here either. 
I'm dialing 911 right now. Beep, 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 beep. Fine. Suit yourself. You can leave now. Oh, I do. But let me tell you something. Uh. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. Karma's a bitch, my friend. Yeah? Well, you're ugly. The man at the door seemed irrelevant compared to how tired I was. Yeah, I don't care. Oh my god, Karma's a bitch, and I'm alone here by myself. Blah, blah, blah. I'm tired, and I'm going to sleep. Ugh, what a bore. I ain't even scared of shit. 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 I'm so brave I could open the front door and not be scared. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Okay. Okay, alright, alright. I'ma open the door, I'ma open the door, I'ma open the door, cause I ain't scared of shit. Oh my god, I texted you and then here you are. What the hell's going on here? Oh my gosh. Rick, I'm so glad you're, I'm so glad you're here. Explain the situation. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. I'd worry about me. Take your pants off. Oh. Oh, wow. Whoa. Hey. Hey, 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 what you doing? What you doing? What you doing? What you doing with the hammer twin? What you doing with the hammer twin? Why you walking with the, why you walking with the hammer twin? Why you? By the way, where's your friend? The guy who was just with you earlier. Uh, he should be back soon. Hmm. So you're all alone here right now, huh? My friends will be back soon. Don't think you heard that part. Am I taller than you? <laughs> oh, damn. They said they just got... They said they pulling up. And they said they 10 deep with black men. Storms like this bring out all kinds of folk. Not all of them know when to stay away. I'm a, uh, got a message here. Just take that rope. Texting, isn't it? Who are you talking to? That's oh, my friends. They almost here. Is that so? Yeah, thanks for coming by, though. You get you, yo, you get yo. Thanks for coming by, though. I'll be. You can head back if you want. You sure about that? Yeah, I just be overreacting sometimes. I'll be scared. I'll be scared of my own shadow. Oh, my own shadow. Sometimes you can go though. <laughs> Maybe I should stick around, and make sure everything's okay. You're not Rick, are you? What'd you just say? I said. You're not Rick, are you? Yellow guy with hands up. Are you gonna kill me? This is my fucking house. And I leave when I want to.
What? What you want? I want what's mine. This house. And you. Me? Everybody want a bad bitch. <laughs> You're trespassing. Okay. You need to leave right now. I don't think so. If anyone's leaving this house, it'll be one of us. One of us? I will gladly walk outside. Whoa! Hey, what the? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We're done. We beat the game chat. the times to text me, bruh. Wait, what was the room with the attic? I'm mm. taking a shower! This is all Fake ass happy music. Jesus! It's the most manliest shit I've seen you do, bro. I told them everything that happened after Mike had left. Rick had called the cops. The storm had quieted down by the time they arrived. And of course, the man was nowhere to be seen. On our drive back, the whole night played over and over into my head. 
how much of a dumbass you were, how many stupid mistakes you made. We think that man we saw secretly lived in that cabin when it wasn't being used and planned on robbing us during our stay. But cops seem to think there was more intent behind this man's action aside from just robbing us. Rick asked me what the man looked like. And after that, he didn't ask any more questions. We think he knew more than he was letting on. But in the end, he gave us a full refund. Nice. Oh my gosh, dude. Survive through the fifth episode. Yeah. 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 I did it, mama. I made it, mama. I made it. Yeah. I made it. Yeah. I made it. Yeah. Over and over and over and over and over and over and over But now here we are The survivor once more Oh my god, oh my god, it's over, oh my god, it's over Oh my god, Zach with another 20 gifted, yo! Chat, first of all, first of all, I gotta give a big, big shout out, bro I gotta give a big, big shout out to uh, Fears of Fathom, and I gotta thank, uh, I gotta shout out Krishna, bro. Shout out to Krishna for uh, making this happen. <laughs> shout out to Krishna for for making this happen, man. Uh, you know, nigga, new people, name tapped in, bro, and uh, help me get this, bro. So I gotta, I gotta shout him out, bro. Shout out to Fears of Fathom for even. You know, letting me do this. They had a, a whole bunch of like great people up here, man. It was cool to see that. Cool to see that and hear from the different creators and shit like that, man. Good game. Scary, eerie vibes, and I hate that shit. I really, really don't like shit like that. So, uh, but I had to finish it. Um, I feel like it, it's crazy because I every time these shits drop, I always play through it. It's just like the shit's scary, but it's still like it's like fun at the same time. Cause there's a lot of jokes to be made um like playing as the character and really getting into the character but yo oh my gosh i really have a headache from screaming jumping and uh i hope y'all enjoyed this bro i hope y'all enjoyed it man shout out to y'all bro shout out to y'all sub sub like 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 comment comment all that good stuff <laughs>